Why all you viewers to be named later? How are we doing today? I know, you can see why that thumbnail, everything else you clicked on to get here. Fable Beard Co. is back on the channel. And it's been kind of um, an extended break from those guys. I think I haven't bought from them in over a year now, coming up on a year. But still, this one really grabbed my attention. That's right. Today we're going to take a look at the lightning rod, my first impressions. Now, what hooked me right away is the scent profile, Fruity Pebbles. Seriously, as he puts it, uh, what do we have here? Lightning Rod, superhero themed beard products offer a scent profile of fruity cereal, crisp lemon, fresh cherries, and sweet pomegranate. You can pick up the combo here for about $37.99. I will leave the best discount code that I can find down below in the description box if you guys would ever want to go. I know at one point, I think I had an affiliate with Fable, but it, I forgot it. So still, it is a very good scent. Um, there's the ingredients on the oil. Take your freeze frame. And where'd you go, where'd you go, where'd you go? There it is on the butter. Okay, this is exactly what you would expect from any Fable beer product you have ever used. It has been the same consistent, really interesting blend pretty much since the wizard took over. I really love the fact that Colin is very outspoken as a company owner. I like the fact he becomes a character, the wizard. He dresses up in a freaking cape, and he has a staff. It's something different, you know? I like the fact that their profiles, or I should say, the um, not so much the profiles, but the names, it's just, they're all different. This one makes me wonder, and I haven't dug too far into it, and for the record, I have yet to watch uh, Brian Beard and Banjo's review, because I wanted to kind of go into this one a little unbiased. I'm wondering if this was part of like the Fable Army subscription that was so popular, they brought it over to the main line. It's a good scent, and I'll be honest with you, when I opened the butter and did the... It's just like I opened a box of Fruity Pebbles. Seriously. I don't know how they've reformulated the butter, but in the couple of days that I've been using it so far, it's a lot creamier than I remember Fable's mainline butter to be. Now, I know on the CBD side, there must be something with that that makes the butter a little softer. It breaks down a lot easier. It's not like I've experienced it before and I've said on my channel where it felt like it was trying rock hard and little pellets in there. This is really, really well done. Is it an all-day scent? Not really. I mean, scent profiles are so subjective for everybody, and everybody has their own opinion of what they want it to be. Let's be honest, Ifra is going to change everything. But right now at this moment, both of these are exactly what I would expect from a Fable Beard Co. product. Really good in beard, really great smell, and the fact that it's caused the family fits. Little notes from the first couple days of testing, like we did with another company. I think I'm going to do this a lot more because I think it brings a different perspective. So... My better half said it smelled better in the container, and it was really, really strong in my beard. She couldn't place what it was. Then I told her, and she went, oh, I can kind of see that. I can kind of see that. The cuteness factor <laughs> said she smelled cinnamon and something else she couldn't put her finger on in the container. In the beard, she still smelled cinnamon and something she likened to like a fruity wax melt. And yes, I have kids, a couple that are, like, one's a teenager, one's turning, another will be in a couple years. You guys have multiple kids in your house. You know you need to have oil diffusers and everything going to eliminate that kid funk. Even though they shower, there's still that kid funk. You walk in the room and you're like, why does that smell? But still. Okay. So, the brat, she said straight away, she smelled vanilla and fruity pebbles. In beard, straight fruity pebbles. Now remember, everybody was segregated. Everybody, anybody's shocked. My camera, it's gonna die a miserable death when I get to it. But like I was saying with the brat, um, in container, she smelled vanilla and fruity pebbles. In beard, straight fruity pebbles. And as I was saying, it was a blind sniff test. Nobody could compare notes. Nobody could compare anything. These were all segregated and yeah. Okay, so for the monkey, in the container, he had no clue. He's like, I don't know how to describe it, but it smells okay. Don't know how to describe it. In beard, he said it's the exact same, but lighter 
And then he turned around and went, well, it kind of smells like something else. So he was a little confused on the blind sniff test, for lack of a better phrase. Remember, I'm the guy who loves the Fruit Loop scent in beard. I like food scents in beard. Some of them are really good. Some of them are not. This one is good. I'm glad it's mainline because when I run out of this, yeah, I'll probably go back and buy more. But I'm going to have my full breakdown and everything else later on on this one. This is just kind of my first impressions of Lightning Rod. Now, we're at the best part of the video for me. I want to know your questions, comments, love, hatred, anger. All that fun stuff right down below. Have you used Lightning Rod yet? Are you, um, God, how can I put it? Do you like food scents and beard? Do you like cereal scents and beard? You know, have you had good experiences with Fable? Have you had bad experiences? I've only really had like one or two bad experiences. And the last one was the last one I bought from Fable, that Irishman scent, which was just, ah. But even funny, if you go back and you look at my review, even the wizard said he wasn't too fond of that one. But still. Now, if it made you laugh, made you cringe, made you cry, made you do any of that during this video, and I'm pretty sure that I did, please hit that big old thumbs up. It's only going to show love and support for the channel, and that is always appreciated. But there we go, guys. My quick, somewhat, <laughs> first impressions of Fable Beard Co.'s The Lightning Rod Combo. I want to thank all of you for watching this one. I hope you're having a great day today, a safe day today, and I look forward to seeing all of you in our very next video.